Hutch and Chester are mobile chess. Chester follows the eyebone and Hutch follows the star sky. They both can be useful in the right circumstances. Chester cannot be brought to the caves and Hutch cannot be brought to the surface. Here's our stats. Chester has 450 HP, regenerates 22 and a half HP every three seconds, can store nine items and has two upgraded forms. Upgrade one is put one nightmare fuel in each slot of his inventory before a full moon starts. And when it starts, he will turn into Shadow Chester, which has three extra inventory slots. Upgrade two is you put one ice gem in each slot of Chester before a full moon again. When it starts, he will turn into Snow Chester, which gives him the extra abilities of an ice box. Hutch has 450 HP, regenerates 22 and a half HP every three seconds, can store nine items, and has three upgraded forms. Upgrade one is putting a light bulb or glow berry in Hutch, cause him to light up until the light bulb rots. Upgrade two is putting a light bulb or glow berry and spear or battle spear in Hutch, which will cause him to become Fugu Hutch, which hurts enemies that attack him 30 each, damaging the spear. He will revert when the spear breaks or when the light bulb rots. Upgrade three is putting a light bulb or glow berry and a one man band in Hutch, which will cause him to turn into Music Box Hutch. This provides a plus 40 sanity a minute boost within a very small radius. Chester is useful for any non-combat scenarios, such as going to a forest and collecting wood after you've cleared out the spiders. Chester can be very annoying and potentially deadly in dangerous areas, as he's not smart enough to run around monsters, so the monsters will aggro on him and he'll lure the monsters straight to you. Chester's shadow form is also helpful for collecting more items at once. However, Snow Chester is basically useless. Food is never an issue in late game, and him cooling down thermal stones is a pure waste of time, because you should be underground in summer. Hutch. Hutch is useful in both combat scenarios and non-combat scenarios. His Fugu form destroys horde mobs, being effective against bats, spiders, giant tentacles, and Splamunkies. His high max HP and HP regen makes him very resilient to attacks, but Splamunkies will still kill him in mere seconds with the huge hordes of them. He can also help collect items like Chester, while also being a useful light source. And his music box form, basically useless, due to poor benefit and expensive one-man band requirement. That's all for the video. If you liked the video, please hit the like button and subscribe.